Hello everyone. Today we are going to discuss about residential house wiring. So what is wiring? Wiring is a phenomenon which is used to connect various electrical and electronics load to a source that is from a uh, energy source through a switch arrangement and wires. So what are types of wiring like uh, battened wiring, tree wiring, staircase wiring, cleared wiring, many types. Generally, how we are going to connect in two types that is parallel wiring and series wiring. In, the, in parallel wiring system, all the electrical loads will be connected parallelly to the source so that the voltage will be in same all over the devices. So the efficiency of this will be common. In series connection, all the loads will be connected in a series manner so that the voltage will be distributed equally. The efficiency of the device will get low. So in this video, we are going to discuss about how the wiring system can be connected in parallel and series to a energy meter for measuring the power that we are consuming for a particular period of time. You can see in your home also the energy meter will be available at the first connection point from the electrical supply board. This is the input point, phase and the neutral point. You are getting a single phase 230 volt AC supply with 50 years frequency. And an energy meter arrangement. This is input PN point and it is output NP point. N for neutral and P for phase point. And from here, this phase point will be connected to a fuse arrangement. This fuse is connected in a serious way to limit the input current and if the current excess the normal operating current value this fuse will disconnect the entire circuit and save the all the electrical components and it is an indicator which is connected in parallel to show whether the voltage is coming into the system from the supply and a lamp we are using an incandescent lamp and a switch arrangement this is the points plug points and just switch to and this NL indicates neutral link I am going to tell what are the components for demonstrating the residential house wiring setup we need a tester a cutter wire cutter and a screwdriver for connection and we am I am going to take a incandescent lamp arrangement you can use a fluorescent lamp or any other loads that you depending upon the availability and two single wire switch this is the wall socket arrangement and this is a fuse setup and it is an indicator whether the supply comes or not you can check with this indicator and an energy meter. This energy meter is an analog type that is a digital type also available in the market. This is the input phase and the neutral point. This is the outer, output neutral and phase point. P N N P. Okay. So as we discussed earlier, the phase and the neutral point will be given to the energy meter. This is the input P and N point. This is the output NP point. From this phase point, the input is given to the seriously connected fuse arrangement. This is the fuse arrangement. From this fuse arrangement output point, the parallel connection comes from this point and the series connection goes out from this point. Here, the switches S1 and S2 will be connected in series to the fuse and the various loads like indicator and this incandescent lamp and this plug point will be connected in parallel to the circuit. Friends, next I am going to check whether the connections we give to the residential house wiring is correct. So initially we are getting a supply from the EB supply, I am taking from this as a source input from here itself. And uh, this indicator will show whether the supply comes from the uh, system. This energy meter does not runs now as there is no electrical load connected to the system so this fuse will burst if there, there is any problem with the system so fuse is correctly con connection and we are going to start a incandescent lamp arrangement the incandescent lamp glows the connection to the incandescent lamp is very good and next I am giving the supply to the socket arrangement so all the loads connected to the sockets are running under a good condition so now see this energy meter this energy meter disc will start to rotate due to the induction process of the energy meter and so the entire system is running under a good condition. So friends this is how we are, we are going to demonstrate the residential house wiring system. 
using the circuit diagram and another procedures we are given in the video you can try it in your lab or you can purchase components from outside and you can do it in your home and see whether the residence level is correct and thank you for watching the video